What's up? Welcome to Fear the Walking Dead Season 2 Recap. So, last time we did a recap for Walking Dead, it was on season... on It was season 11, and... Yeah, so now we go back to Fear the Walking Dead. And at the end of the Fear the Walking Dead, Nick met Strand and welcomed him on his boat. The Abigail. So this season starts off with with a big explosion as we see Daniel, Ophelia, and out and Nick and Alicia and Strand and they and you know they get on the Strand's boat and base, and we see Chris too. Yeah. And Travis. Don't forget about Chris and Travis. And they're all, you know, doing their own things, like you know, but tra but Strand has mysterious motives. You know, and 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 you know and, and Madison starts, you know, questioning him. Like he won't like when be so Alicia gets a call from this other survivor named Jack and immediately falls in love with him. And he says he had, like, he talks about his girlfriend and all that stuff. So, meanwhile, with, Sh with, Sh meanwhile with Strand, me me actually, meanwhile, there's this, the, there's this, there was this random miniseries called Fear the Walking Dead Flight 462. And those characters come into this season, because random. And they let them on, but Strand's like, yeah, no, we are not letting them on because, you know, they could be villains. So, so, yeah, so Strand immediately, so Strand immediately cuts the rope, letting them out there to die. And Strand was right, as Jack and his friend, Jack and his friend, aboard, aboard the Abigail and take it hostage. Yeah. And one of Jack's friends is played by... It's by the way, African. I remembered it. I said it. No, watching. Now I don't remember. Yeah, you'll know it. So anyway, so yeah, so they kidnap them, and it's like, hey, and she's like, hey, if it's what we had is real. So meanwhile, so meanwhile, the girl from before who who strained, cut the rope off of, kidnaps Travis and works with. Ch Jack's friend, cause he's, cause she's evil now, and it's like, hey, this is all your fault, and I told my friend about you, so you're captured, Travis, and he's like, hey, I, hey, I don't mean to cause cause any harm, but, <laughs> but yeah, I don't mean to cause any. Harm. So, yeah. So meanwhile, so yeah. So meanwhile, with Nick, he go, strands like, "Hey, Nick, I need you to find an old friend of mine because in the past we see a, he had a friend named Thomas Abigail, who's played by Bat Cap Commander Kane himself, Doug Gray Scott. Kind of weird that they would get this guy before you would later found that one, but he he yeah he gets his yeah." In the past, yeah, and he met this other guy named, named Luis, who who Nick gets, and Madison's obviously not happy that 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 Strand would ask Nick to risk his life for a random guy they barely know. I mean, so then these guys, so yeah, so it's revealed that they're going to Baja, where where Abigail is. Abigail is, you know, but Lewis gets killed and R.I.P. R.I.P. Lewis, man, you barely knew you, you barely knew you. I was starting to like you, but yeah. Also, speaking of Lewis, if when we start doing H2O recaps, I will because I love that show. So if when we do H2O recaps, talk about that Lewis on that show, please tell me if when we do H2O recaps because I love H2O. That's like water. So anyway. They get there and we they see Lewis's mom played by Elena from the Fosters and she's yes Elena from the Fosters and and Jake came from Batwoman are in the show the show did not get any more ridiculous 
So yeah, so what happens is, is that Yeah, so Daniel starts seeing his ex wife starts seeing his wife and tries to like convince Ophelia like saying, Hey, come with me, I've been seeing your mom. I can take you to her Meanwhile Dan yeah, well Daniel gets captured and Daniel gets captured. Of course he does. Meanwhile, meanwhile, Nick and and Nick and Elena from the Fosters, they get close, but but it's revealed that Elena from the Fosters is keeping a bunch of walkers, just like Herschel did in season two. And she still thinks they're people, just like Herschel did in season two. So. So yeah. So meanwhile, unlike Herschel in season two, Elena lets oh, Madison's like, "Hey, you're evil, so I'm gonna let you die among the walkers you tried to save." Bye, and yeah, and and also what happens is that Daniel gets captured and 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 he sees his wife, so he decides to burn them all with everyone thinking he's dead, and Ophelia is obviously upset, thinking her father's dead. They don't see the body, but I'm just gonna pretend like he is, cause season two. So Nick decides to be like, "Hey, Elena was right. We are monsters, and I'm not going with you. So we destroy everything we touch. So I'm gonna just walk by myself and leave you guys." So Nick does that. He leaves, and you know. So me. So yeah, he he leaves because it's. Nick, he leaves them, and he, and he see, and we also get a flashback on Nick's past, where back in when Nick was in rehab, he met this girlfriend, he met this girl Gloria that was his girlfriend in the first season, in the, in the opener, and, and they ended up, you know, spending some time together, Nick found out that his father died by, by a, constru a construction accident, but Madison really knows what happened. Madison really knows that. Madison really knows what happened. So meanwhile, so Nick, so Nick's obviously destroyed and decides to get up on the drugs, and that's where he, and that's when he sees Gloria dead, and that's how the whole season starts. Whole first season starts. So Nick ends up running into this place called Colonia, where it's run by run by this guy named Alejandro with his friend. Luciana. If you haven't seen Luciana before, she was Sophia. On, she was, she was, Sophia's. She was Sophia. She, she was Zod's. She was Don's boyfriend from Prison Break, and they kind of fall in love, and they kind of fall in love and start dating. So, meanwhile. Meanwhile, I'm back with the other gang. They find this hotel. They find this hotel. Where, guess what? Ophelia abandons them. She basically just, she's like, hey, she, her, maybe her dad was right about no hope. And she's like, hey, he was wrong. And then she's like, okay, I'm bolting. Bye. And leaves Alicia to be control, control being, Alicia to be overturned by at least she'd be overturned by walkers. So then what happens is, is that, what's that? then a, a girl named Elena shows up saying that in the, in the past, there was this, there was this, in the past there was this wet, there was this wedding, but, but the dad, but the groom, but the father turned into a walker and ate his daughter and Elena let that happen watching the mom played by Elena's mom from Supergirl watch. So Elena's mom from Supergirl has kind of got, gone a little nutso and totally wants to kill Elena for killing, watching, killing her daughter. Yeah, she wants to kill Elena for killing her daughter. You know, so when she shows up and one day she accidentally stabs Strand because she was in her dr drugged out thing and killed Strand. Yeah, she kills Strand. Strand. So meanwhile, oh right, I forgot to mention the Travis thing. Is that I mean Travis back in back in the boat arc, 
there, there's been some little, you know, craziness in Chris. He's been, you know, he tried to, he, he, wa he wanted to walk. He was so overcome with grief of his mom that he almost watched Madison die. He threatened Alicia. He tried to, he tried to kill Alicia and, and Madison in their sleep. So Travis first didn't want to believe his son. So he was like, hey, we're leaving, we're leaving and just trying to find out what happened to you. So immediately they meet these three guys who seemed nice, but guess what? Chris is annoying and Travis is trying to tell him like, hey, these dudes aren't nice. We shouldn't believe them. And he's like, oh, dad, you don't know nothing. These guys are, these guys are my friends now. Crap off. Do you see? Do you see? Even my, int my impersonation of Chris shows how annoying he is in the se in the second half. I absolutely disliked Chris in the second half. Yeah. So yeah, so when this got, they're in this farm and they're in this farm and they, they're in this farm and they see this guy, they see this guy, you know, run, they see this guy is guy who wants them off their property, so he shoots one of the other friends. So what does Chris do? He shoots an innocent man and kills him. So Chris is so Travis is so. Then we cut to so Travis is so they want to help him, but Chris and but Chris and the others want to kill their friend. So Chris decides to be like, "Hey, Dad, do you want some food?" Bam. Gets gets him in a as one of the other guys kills his friend. So Travis decides, oh, after that, I'm obviously gonna go with the guys just kill that guy and send my dad, who I totally trust. Bye. So then he walk. So he walks away. Well, so tra Well, look, so Madison she looks for Nick, and Ma and Alicia is obviously not happy for some reason because she. With Alina, she saw that these two guys saw Nick somewhere and, you know, couldn't question about it. So, yeah. So, Nick, so one of the, Tra Travis saw the lights that were meant for Nick, finds, finds Mass and the others, and it's like, hey, finds Mass and the others, and it's like, hey, um, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to, like, I, I didn't mean to leave Chris, so, I didn't mean to leave Chris. So Madison sees those next day. Madison sees those guys and it's like, "Hey, where's Chris?" And he and they're like, "Hey, Chris was like, you know, helping us until he, you know, hurt himself and died." So yeah, and Travis obviously sees these guys and tries to confront them, being like, "Hey, where's 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 Chris?" But but they want they try to tell their own story of events and you know they tell their real story about how Tr Chris was injured injured clinging to life but they shot him dead and what does Travis do he goes over drives and cr kicks their asses sorry butts he kicks their butts he goes over grind Madison tries to stop him some other guys try to stop him but Chris knocks him but Travis knocks him so bad that guy dies now the brothers want to now the brothers want Travis dead, and it's Rick Grimes esque. So yeah, so Travis is now you know now yeah. So meanwhile, with Nick, Nick is now dating Lucy Nip, and these guys before att attacked the place. But but there's a story. Yeah, there's this really gruesome scene where there's a zombie, and Nick puts his fingers and gouges that guy's eyes out. It's gross. It's one of the most brutal scenes in all of Fear the Walking Dead. Nick puts his two fingers and gouges that guy's eye out. Gross. Gross, Fear. Why are you doing this to me, Fear? So anyway, back, so anyway, back when, so yeah, so Alejandro, the guy is like, is like, hey, he's some healer. He's, he's been able to, been able to bite, he's been able to survive from bites, but Nick's like, no, you, you, no, you don't. You just use that to have Luciana Lus believe you. So Luciana, let's go. And she's like, no, I'm not going anywhere. 
she met Alejandro flying her all the time. Yeah, I know the line of reveal the story. So the dude decides to you know, drive a car and you know, Alicia is like they continue looking for Nick, but Alicia's like, What are you doing? Um, Alicia, don't you notice what you mean what are you doing? Can't you see they're looking for Nick? Wow is that really not a smart thing to say. So yeah. So Strand decides to stay at the hotel because he decides to find out what happens to him on season three. And yeah. So they go they go looking for Nick, but but Nick Nick is Nick convinces all the others to to leave Colonia and go with him. Go with him, go with him, and they do. But then they're captured by, but then they're, but then they're captured. Yeah, Travis is, yeah, Travis is, yeah, we should talk about Travis. So Travis is continuing to be processed, but they're like, hey, if you let Travis go, we'll leave and never come back. And she's like, okay, but 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 the two brothers find out the guy Travis kills actually dead. So they want revenge on Travis and his family for killing his killing their brother. So they go and attack and beat up Travis, but but they have a gun in Travis's face. So then Alicia decides to stab the main dude that she was falling in love with, it. and it goes nowhere. They're mad at them, but I'm pro we're probably never gonna see it. So anyway, Travis gets so Travis is getting processed. So they're like, "Hey, we'll leave." So, meanwhile, all the bad guys are shooting at Alejandro, but he's able to survive until so Madison and so Madison and Travis go to where Nick was, and they're like, Alicia, just stay there. But Alicia doesn't. She's like, I'm not. She's not smart. So she goes to find Alejandro, and they and they're like, Hey, where's Nick? And he's like, Oh, you're Nick's mom. He went. He went to the. He found a weird helicopter and went to go follow it. So, yeah. So while they're doing that, Nick and the other, so Nick and the other get ambushed. Get ambushed from, from a bat, from from these army guys who kick Nick in the face. And and shoot Luciana, but she's not dead yet. Who knows? Me, yeah. Meanwhile, with yeah, I think Luciana, Luciana. Is on her own when she gets captured. When she, when a mysterious guy's like, Welcome to America. And that's where her story goes until season three. Um, is there anything I'm else missing from this? Se I don't think. I think I covered everything. So that's season two of Fear, Fear of the Walking Dead. This had 15 episodes and had more, you know, more things happen than the last season. We had the death of R.I.P. Chris. R.I.P. Chris. Travis killed the guys that killed Chris. Like, they got what they deserved. They killed Chris. So, Chris, so Travis went all over Grimes and killed them. And... As, yeah, Nick killed Lu Luciana. I didn't expect Nick to get a second girlfriend in this season. Like, he and Luciana were cute together. And, yeah. Yeah, and also, you know, Doug Gray Scott had to be killed off. R.I.P. Doug Gray Scott character. And, you know, only before dying, Alina from the Fosters mad him for, you know, killing her son. And, and you know, told him to leave. And, uh, you know, craziness. But, but anyway... That's it for this video. I'll see you next time when we see Walking Fear the Walking Dead season three. Where will the characters go next after this? Will we see Nick get captured? Who knows? Anyway, let's see season three. Boom. Also, yeah, Chris is Chris was the worst character of the season. He w he basically wanted to defy his dad and you know. Anyway, that's it. See you next time. What are we gonna do for this season outro? So anyway, 
But anyway, see you next time for some more. For next, yeah, tomorrow we'll be starting the season three recap. So anyway, see you next time for season three. Feel the watch day. Boom.